about it. I don't think about it. It's locked. When you buy, you get the key. Cassie finds the book in the stranger's shop. And she is, she loves scary stories. And she's had a, probably a whole collection before. And she sees this book, and this book she's never read before. And doesn't have an author. And like, she's really, it, it, it entices her. So she buys the book, of course. There's a warning, plainly printed on the first page. And she reads it aloud to her brother just to scare him. And it comes alive. And the creepy part is, it may be just her imagination of what she created this monster to be. That's what's walking outside her windows trying to scare her. Main thing about this movie, it tells you there's this horrible, like, scary story, and then it's like, but don't think about it. And, and of course you're gonna think about it. That evil thing, it's real. The whole deal, it's got your brother. Oh my gosh, I had no idea it would be this frightening. I love walking into the sets for the first time. It's like everything you've been building up to finally comes to life. The evil thing is this big monster. I think it's like six feet tall. It looks really, really real. It has like all these nasty teeth and it has two heads too to add to everything. And split. One head snaps at one kid and one head snaps at the other kid. So it's like always keeping the audience on their toes. They got slime all over it, and it's just, just nasty, and it's scary. <laughs> this thing is good. Like, we're gonna truly frighten. I, I'm scared, like, it works when we're doing scenes, because we go in, and the monster is there, and it, it does frighten me. When I first saw it, and when I still see it today, I'm just thinking in my head, how cool is this thing? Oh my gosh, it's just, just the coolest thing I've ever seen. This is um, the monster's lair. The tunnel and everything in the lair is really cool and um, much more claustrophobic looking than I thought it would be. I think that the lair seems to be fun to film as long as the inside isn't gooey. Because I don't want to get gooey and icky. Ah! Ah! R.L. Stein wrote so many books about so many creepy, creepy things that. They were actually truly frightening. You don't want to read these books alone at nighttime. He puts in the perfect mixture of a little bit of comedy sometimes, a little bit of horror, and just it just grabs you. He's great at making things really, really scary without being, you know, still being appropriate for kids. I remember Goosebumps. Like, his Goosebump books were the biggest thing ever. And I was actually, when I was that age, I was kind of scared to read the books. Oh. In the movie, there are a variety of pranks. I really wish I could pull some of these things off. They're very sophisticated. I'm the Pumpkin Queen. I will conquer the world. I think it's going to be the greatest night of my life. I go up on stage. I do the annual hitting of the pumpkin pinata, expecting candy to fall upon my head. And what comes out is 600 live cockroaches. Mm. They're kind of crunchy, but they taste pretty good. Want some? Yes! <laughs> so we did the take. I freaked out in the tank, and then it finished. <laughs> and that's when I really freaked out. <laughs> and I still feel like they're on me, and I'm going to go home and take five showers. So after all those fall down upon me, I lose my balance, and then I fall off the stage and hit face first into the huge orange pumpkin cake. And, oh my god, it was like the frosting was just stuck in my nose several days after, and it was just disgusting. <laughs> the character I play is Max Keller, and he is basically um, a scaredy cat six-year-old. Whenever something that's just the least bit scary, it gets in his head and he's, he's got, it's sort of like a what ifer. He keeps on thinking about it. You wanted me to read you this book, right? You, you're not mad anymore. Accidents happen. 
his sister Cassie reads him a story called The Evil Thing, and Max can't stop thinking about these sort of things, bringing the monster to life. The evil thing is not real. Unless you think about it. In the story, they tell Max not to think about it, which is something that Max just can't do. Oh, Priscilla. <laughs> That's really fun. <laughs> yeah, she's, she's mean, but I think in a fun way. She's not just straight out mean in your face. She's really manipulative. Brittany Kern, who plays Priscilla, captures perfectly the mean girl of everyone's high school. Everybody has a mean girl. Didn't anyone tell you? The Halloween dance isn't until next Friday. My character, he is uh, kind of like the coolest guy at school, but he's not really the smartest. Dude, you're not supposed to like it. Oh, really? Yeah, really. Well, how you like it, huh? <laughs> he always wants to do the right thing. His heart's in the right place. Cody is uh, hes an excellent actor and a very, very popular guy with the teen girls. So, like Sean, pumpkin queen and pumpkin king. <laughs> Great, scary movie, and it's great for the family. And you don't really see that. There's not many scary movies that kids can go see. I love being scared. On Halloween, um, we went to a haunted house, and it's just fun. I love that feeling of not knowing like what you're going to do. With this, it's mostly about the story and about the characters, and the scariness fits in perfectly with it, so that's not what's driving the film. Kids want real scares, good stories, good characters. There's an audience that's so hungry for material like this. It's very scary, it's not gross, it's not horrific, it's fun and it's scary. Cassie is very in tune with herself. She knows exactly what she wants, she knows exactly who she is, and no one's gonna tell her what to do. Check out the freak. It was interesting because goth isn't what I am known for usually. I'm known for long blonde hair and that's how everyone knows me usually. When I saw her on set and she was like, hey, what's up? For the first couple seconds I was like, who is this person? Like, I don't... And then I was like, oh my gosh, wow. Like, I was like shocked.